Welcome to The Wildlife Kingdom, a captivating series dedicated to exploring the wonders of nature and its untamed beauty. In this journey through the natural world, we delve into the intricate and diverse ecosystems, showcasing the wild and extraordinary inhabitants that make our planet a truly remarkable and awe-inspiring place. Join us as we unveil the mysteries, observe the behaviors, and marvel at the incredible adaptations of the flora and fauna that inhabit the wildlife kingdom. Throughout this video, we will embark on a captivating exploration of the incredible Komodo dragon. Our learning journey will take us into the heart of the Indonesian islands, where these majestic reptiles roam. We'll delve into various aspects of their biology, behavior, and ecological significance, unraveling the mysteries that make them the world's largest living lizards. Prepare to be fascinated by the evolutionary marvels and ecological intricacies of these awe-inspiring creatures as we navigate through the captivating world of the Komodo dragon together. Fact number one. The Komodo dragon, Varanus komodoensis, stands as an awe-inspiring testament to the diversity of the Indonesian archipelago, finding its roots in the islands of Komodo, Rinka, Flores, and Gili Motang. Nestled within this tropical expanse, the species has become an iconic representative of the region's rich biodiversity. These islands, situated in the Lesser Sunda chain, provide a unique ecological niche for the Komodo dragon. Their habitat spans a range of landscapes, from dense forests to arid savannas, showcasing the species' adaptability to varied environments. It is within this diverse setting that the Komodo dragon has evolved distinctive traits and behaviours that set it apart as the largest living lizard on Earth. The story of the Komodo dragon's origins is entwined with the geological and ecological history of the Indonesian islands. These formidable creatures have adapted to the challenges presented by their surroundings, becoming highly skilled predators and scavengers. The island's isolation has played a crucial role in shaping the evolutionary path of the Komodo dragon, contributing to unique features such as island gigantism, the phenomenon where certain species grow larger in isolation than their mainland counterparts. Beyond being a fascinating example of evolutionary adaptation, the Komodo dragon is deeply embedded in the cultural and ecological fabric of the region. The islands it calls home, particularly Komodo National Park, have become vital conservation areas, aiming to protect not only the dragons themselves, but also the delicate ecosystems they inhabit. As these reptiles continue to navigate the changing dynamics of their environment, their presence serves as a reminder of the intricate interplay between species and their surroundings, showcasing the intricate dance of life on the Indonesian archipelago. Fact number two. Renowned as the world's largest living lizard, this creature commands attention with its impressive size and formidable presence. Adult males of this species typically attain lengths ranging from 8 to 9 feet, 2.4 to 2.7 meters, making them a true giant among their reptilian counterparts. These immense dimensions are complemented by a robust build, with males often weighing around 200 pounds, 91 kilograms, or more. It is this extraordinary size that contributes to the Komodo dragon's status as an apex predator in its native habitat. With their powerful limbs, formidable claws and sharp teeth, these colossal lizards are well equipped for capturing and subduing prey, reinforcing their position as one of the most imposing creatures in the animal kingdom. The size of the Komodo dragon not only underscores its evolutionary prowess, but also serves as a testament to the unique ecological dynamics at play in the islands it inhabits. Island gigantism, a phenomenon where certain species grow larger in isolation, is particularly pronounced in the case of the Komodo dragon, showcasing the species' ability to adapt and thrive in its specific environment. Visitors to these Indonesian islands are often struck by the sheer magnitude of these reptilian giants, emphasizing the importance of conservation efforts to ensure the continued existence of this remarkable species and the delicate ecosystems they inhabit. The immense size of the Komodo dragon, a marvel of nature, 
invites us to contemplate the intricacies of its evolutionary journey and the crucial role it plays in the intricate web of life. Fact number three. The Komodo dragon's extraordinary sense of smell stands as a testament to its prowess as a skilled hunter and scavenger in the diverse landscapes of its Indonesian habitat. These colossal lizards possess a highly developed olfactory system that plays a pivotal role in their survival. Gifted with the ability to detect scents from impressive distances, Komodo dragons can pinpoint the location of carrion, a crucial skill in their scavenging behavior. Astonishingly, they can sense the scent of a dead or dying animal from up to six miles, 9.5 kilometers, away, showcasing an olfactory acuity that surpasses many other reptilian species. This heightened sense of smell is not merely a physiological marvel. It is a vital adaptation that has evolved over time in response to the challenges presented by their environment. The Indonesian islands, with their varied terrains and ecosystems, demand a keen sensory awareness for survival. The Komodo dragon's ability to detect the scent of decaying flesh over vast distances allows them to efficiently locate potential food sources, contributing to their success as opportunistic feeders. Whether navigating dense forests or open grasslands, the Komodo dragon's acute sense of smell serves as a navigational tool guiding them to sustenance in a landscape where resources may be scattered and unpredictable. As we delve into the intricacies of the Komodo dragon's sensory capabilities, it becomes apparent that their olfactory prowess is not only a marvel of nature, but a key element in the ecological tapestry of their habitat. It is a reminder of the remarkable adaptations that have shaped these creatures enabling them to thrive in the challenging and dynamic environments that define their island home. Fact number four. The phenomenon of island gigantism finds a captivating exemplification in the colossal proportions of the Komodo dragon, captivating scientists and naturalists alike with its evolutionary implications. Nestled within the Indonesian archipelago on islands like Komodo, Rinka, and Flores, the Komodo dragon has grown to become the largest living lizard on Earth. Island gigantism, a biological phenomenon observed in various species inhabiting isolated islands, refers to the tendency for these insular populations to evolve larger body sizes compared to their mainland counterparts. The unique ecological conditions characterized by limited resources and isolation from mainland predators are believed to be the driving forces behind this intriguing evolutionary pattern. For the Komodo dragon, island gigantism is a strategic adaptation to the challenges and opportunities presented by its specific island habitat. The absence of large mammalian predators allowed these lizards to exploit their environment with fewer constraints on size. In this evolutionary crucible, the Komodo dragon has developed not only formidable physical dimensions, but also a suite of adaptations that contribute to its success as a top predator. The larger size provides advantages in hunting, scavenging, and establishing dominance within the ecosystem. Island gigantism, as observed in the Komodo dragon, serves as a living illustration of how isolation can sculpt the evolutionary trajectory of a species. The unique set of circumstances on these Indonesian islands has favoured the development of this awe-inspiring reptilian giant, offering valuable insights into the dynamic interplay between environment and biology. As scientists continue to unravel the mysteries of island gigantism, the Komodo dragon stands as a living testament to the complex dance of adaptation that unfolds in the isolation of Earth's remote and distinct ecosystems. Fact number five. The thermoregulatory strategies of the Komodo dragon unveil a fascinating adaptation to its tropical island habitat, where temperature fluctuations play a pivotal role in the daily lives of these magnificent reptiles. As ectothermic creatures, Komodo dragons lack the internal mechanisms to regulate their body temperature independently, compelling them to rely on external sources for thermal equilibrium. To achieve optimal physiological functioning, these giants have evolved an intricate dance with their environment, deftly utilizing the sun's radiant warmth and the cooling embrace of shade or water. 
basking in the sun constitutes a crucial aspect of the Komodo dragon's thermoregulation. With their massive bodies sprawled out in the open, they absorb the sun's energy, allowing their metabolic processes to kick into high gear. This sun-seeking behavior not only aids in digestion, but also ensures that their bodies reach the preferred operating temperature. In the blazing tropical sun of their Indonesian home, the dragons may be seen strategically positioning themselves to absorb maximum sunlight, often atop elevated surfaces for an unobstructed exposure. Conversely, when the tropical heat becomes intense or they need to cool down, Komodo dragons exhibit an astute understanding of their environment. They seek refuge in the shade of vegetation or retreat to bodies of water, where the cooling effect helps regulate their body temperature. This dual reliance on sunbathing and seeking shade underscores the Komodo dragon's adeptness at navigating the dynamic temperature gradients of their habitat showcasing an evolutionary balance that allows them to thrive in the diverse ecosystems of the Indonesian islands. The thermoregulatory behavior of the Komodo dragon not only highlights its adaptability to the tropical environment, but also serves as a reminder of the intricate relationships between organisms and their surroundings. In this daily ritual of basking and cooling, we witness a remarkable example of how nature has sculpted these creatures to harmonize with the rhythms of the sun, shade and water, ensuring their survival in the challenging island landscapes they call home. Thank you all for joining this exploration into the fascinating realm of the Komodo dragon. Your enthusiasm and engagement have truly enriched our learning experience. Throughout our time together, we've uncovered the intricacies of these remarkable creatures, from their island gigantism to their sophisticated thermoregulation strategies. We've marveled at their acute sense of smell, learned about their hunting techniques, and discussed the challenges they face in the wild. As we conclude this chapter, I commend your curiosity and active participation. Let's carry forward this newfound knowledge about the Komodo dragon, recognizing its significance in the broader context of biodiversity and conservation. Your commitment to learning is inspiring, and I look forward to continuing this educational journey with you.